And the Shih Tzu is brave and fearless. They bark if they hear something to alert you to danger. And this breed gets along well with other dogs and pets in the family. The Shih Tzu will bark when they hear suspicious noises outside and alert you to any danger that may be lurking around. They are also very playful, so if you have children, that would be a good combination. As long as the kids know how to handle a dog, the Shih Tzu can get hurt easily, just like any other dog. If you are looking for a small lap dog or just a good companion for your children, then the Shih Tzu may be the right dog for you. Hello everyone, and welcome back to your favorite smart dog lover. In this video, we are going to be highlighting the things only Shih Tzu dog owners know about their pets. Don't forget to hit like if you haven't already. Also, subscribe and turn on notifications for more contents like this that will help you know this breed better. Let's get it started, shall we? Number 10. Shih Tzus come from Tibet. So how did the Shih Tzu travel from Tibet to China? The historians say that it must have been traders who transported these animals. But the problem is that these dogs were not used as pets during those days and therefore would not be traded for goods. Shih Tzus were not even domesticated until centuries later, in fact many centuries later. In other words, before the 19th century, Shih Tzus were only used for working purposes and not kept as pets. So when these animals were transported from Tibet to China, they must have been taken there by visitors who wanted to take home a gift for their family. Number 9. Shih Tzus mean little lion. The Shih Tzu is descended from Tibetan and Chinese breeds, brought to southern China by nomadic tribes. The dogs have been bred for centuries to be both companions and guard dogs. They were called lion dogs or more accurately, little lion. As the Chinese word for dog Shen also means lion. In the West, Shih Tzu is known for their long, thick coats and round faces. These characteristics were bred in to give the dogs a regal appearance. The Shih Tzu became a favored pet in Chinese courts and Buddhist monasteries. Number 8. They were nearly wiped out during the Communist Revolution. And the Shih Tzu was almost wiped out during the Chinese Communist Revolution. The Shih Tzu is a toy dog that originates in Tibet and was brought to China by Buddhist monks. The dog, however, became very popular in China and was even featured in the Chinese Imperial Palace. After the Communist Revolution, however, the Shih Tzu nearly went extinct. The breed also suffered greatly in the late 1950s and 1960s as many dogs were killed by communist soldiers and officials. In some cases, whole litters of puppies were drowned or buried alive by officials who did not want live witnesses behind. Many dogs were also killed during the chaos of the Cultural Revolution, which started in 1966 and ended in 1976. Number 7. Shih Tzus were brought to the US and UK through tougher conditions. The Shih Tzu is a breed of dog that has been documented back as far as the 10th century. The breed was created in China and was named for the parents of the first recorded ancestor, a Shih Tzu dog. After being imported to England from China, the English began exporting them to other countries in Europe. Once a type of dog is established in a region, it tends to stay there. So what happened? As time flew by, the Shih Tzu was established in Europe by being exported from England there. But once it was established in those countries, the dogs were not then exported back to England. That doesn't make much sense. Why would you export a dog breed from one country to another and then stop exporting the same breed back again? It happened because when the Shih Tzu arrived in Europe, they were mistaken for an entirely different kind of dog that was already there. And once they had been established as that other kind of dog, they stayed that way. Number 6. Many celebrities have owned Shih Tzus. Shih Tzu can be good pets and also easy to train and they are very affectionate. Many celebrities have owned Shih Tzus, including Nicole Richie, Mariah Carey, Beyonce, Colin Farrell, and Bill Gates. Queen Elizabeth II, 
had he even owned a pair of this breed. A pet Shih Tzu can be a great addition to your family and can provide years of companionship. Shih Tzu is one of the most popular dog breeds in the United States celebrity circle. There are many reasons for this. One of the main reasons is that they are very easy to take care of. Shih Tzu dogs also make good family pets as they are great with children and other animals. They are also quite affectionate and will form strong bonds with their owners. Number five, they are very athletic. Shih Tzu are fun and friendly. They love to jump, play, and run around. They are also very intelligent and trainable, but they do like to be in charge, so lots of gentle positive reinforcement is needed during training. Once trained though, a Shih Tzu is great at following directions and tricks. Shih Tzu are already known for being great watchdogs, but they are also very good at being little clowns and can bring some laughter into your day. Shih Tzu have a lifespan of 11 to 16 years under the proper care and feeding. Their grooming needs are minimal, as their coat does not shed much. However, they will need regular brushing. The Shih Tzu breed is good with people of all ages and other dogs if properly socialized. Number 4. Shih Tzu is common with keratitis. Keratitis is an acute inflammation of the cornea, the outermost layer of the eye. The symptoms in dogs include redness, pain, sensitivity to light, squinting, and swelling in and around the eyes. A vet will provide antibiotic ointments and may order diagnostic tests. But there are also other treatment options, laser surgery and other procedures that will give your pet eye more normal appearance. But there are various home remedies that can help reduce the inflammation and mitigate its effects. It is important to keep your Shih Tzu dog away from hot weather, improve his diet and check his eyes regularly. Another important rule is not to clean his eyes with strong solutions as it can lead to blindness. Number three, Cancer Dog. Shih Tzu dogs are known to be healthy breeds and they generally live to be around 13 years old on average. But they can also be prone to certain health conditions. For example, they may develop eye problems, skin allergies, and back problems. Cancer is considered the main cause of death for Shih Tzu breed dogs. This can include bone cancer, which often occurs in the jaw of the Shih Tzu dog. It usually develops when the dog is older and is usually linked to genetics or environmental factors. This type of cancer that affects the tissue of bones and it typically spreads from the initial tumor site to other areas of the body. Dogs with this form of cancer will often experience pain in their joints and may have swelling in one or more joints. Number two, Smokey. Smokey was a Shih Tzu and his age was 23. He was born in Florida and lived in Florida also. He died from cancer at the age of 23. There are many dogs that have lived past their 20s. Smokey was the oldest dog of his breed. A few months before his death, he was taken to the vet for a checkup. Smokey was still going strong. His owner says that Smokey could run and jump like a puppy, even when he was almost 20 years old. Number one, the Shih Tzu personality is good around other dogs. The Shih Tzu is a hardy dog that can live in a variety of climates and conditions. This makes them great companions for people who are active and enjoy spending time outdoors. The personality of this breed makes them great around other dogs and people. They are very playful and affectionate, but they are also independent thinkers who aren't afraid to tell you if they don't like something. The Shih Tzu is excellent with children, especially when socialized as puppies. The small size of this dog makes a good choice for someone who lives in an apartment or home where space is at a premium. They are known for being good with children and other dogs. They can be a little bossy with other dogs, but when it comes to children, they are very gentle and loving. Shih Tzu dog breeds are especially good around kids.
That's all folks. Tell us your best experience with your Shih Tzu breed in the comments section and let us know if it is recommendable to have one. Before we go, do make sure to like and subscribe so that you don't miss out on any dog related content from us. Goodbye for now guys.